Hey guys, how's it going? How are we all doing today? I'm doing all right. Please excuse the way I look. I have not slept for two days. Insomnia is not fun. And I'm getting another fever blister. So that's three now in the last like two months. I had one here, I had one here, and now I'm getting one here. So good times, good times. But other than that, let's just get into the makeup. I am gonna start with my Aptogen Soothe and Hydrate Activated Mist by Youth to the People. Ah, I spray that everywhere and this is what it looks like. It's gonna last me forever. And I'm gonna go in with my Skin Aqua UV Super Moisture Milk Pink SPF 50 plus 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 plus. And it's a physical. SPF so we are officially quarantined and I know there's people that actually can't even leave their houses we're not there yet um we we're just um doing it on our own we're only gonna go out for the necessities to protect other people and ourselves. So that's what that's what's going on with that. My hair looks so flat today. I just wet it a little to kind of zhuzh it up, but it's still wet. And then I'm gonna do the same mixture I did yesterday. The Smashbox Photo Finish Primerizer, my baby, and the Chanel Le Beige. I hope I'm saying that right. I think I am, Le Beige and about six squirts of the Smashbox Primerizer and two of Le Beige. I just like saying that, I feel fancy. Le Beige. Norma's in here with me, but she's on the uh, bed already. She's, she's done with today. She's not even trying. She's like, I wanna go for a walk, okay? Which we will in a little bit. Don't you fear, Nora. I'm not going to take this way down my neck because I don't want to get it on my white shirt. But normally I would. Normally I don't get dressed in the clothes that I'm going to wear out for the day. I don't get dressed until the very last. But I'm trying to wear a pretty shoot for you guys. Pretty shoot? A pretty shirt for you guys. It says love is everywhere, and it should be, especially at this time, right now. And my insomnia is just so bad, because I'm just a nervous wreck. Not about, war I mean about the world stuff, but about like my husband being laid off, and my son being home. It's like, how am I gonna keep him entertained? They gave us like little packets and my teach his teacher texts me and she's like, I don't even know what's in these packets. She goes, I don't even know if it's if it's too hard for him, if it's too easy for him. She's like, I don't even know, honestly, Jen, what's what's in these packets. So I gotta look them over and see if they're even anything that's gonna help us during this time. And then I'm gonna go in with the same combo that I did yesterday, cause it was beautiful and it lasted all day and it looked like my skin, but it was like dewy, but not too dewy. And it just lasted amazingly. So Laura Mercier um, Tinted Moisturizer and the Bite Beauty Changemaker Foundation. They're both like tinted moisturizers. So I'm gonna go in with those. A little squirt of each and I'm just gonna go in with my hands my son's out there and he's got his headphones on so he's talking like really loud <laughs> I look like a penny <laughs> don't don't fear foundation is coming it just warms me up See, 
all better. That's what I start to do when spring comes. Start to try to warm up my complexion because then I start wearing self tanner and stuff like that. So I gotta get my face to match my neck or my body. I mean, not my neck, my body. Okay, let me wipe my hands off and check this out. See how it looks in my little mirror that I forgot to grab. Of course, I knew I forgot something. Oh, why, Norma? Give me one second while I grab that mirror. You could probably see my pajamas. They're Mickey Mouse. Heck yeah, I'm not going anywhere. Why would I wear pants? It's just a beautiful combo. And what's nice about that, um, warming up the skin like that is you can really see if you've missed a spot. <laughs> so it helps. Um, I think I need a little concealer today because your girl needs some help in the sleep department just to brighten it up. Cause, uh, I'm not sleeping. What do I do all night? I, I read, I sit on my phone, I roll around in bed, pray, <laughs> pray for sleep. My sister-in-law so sweet. She's like, you can call me literally any hour of the night. Not that I ever would. I would never do that to anybody, but she's like, you can seriously call me anytime. I don't care what time it is, Jen, just call me. I just thought that was so sweet. And I, she literally would answer the phone. I know she would. She's like precious. Okay, so for some bronzer. Oh, I better set that. I'm going to set that with my It Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores. In the pressed powder. It'll be the powder and then I didn't even I am like forgetting everything today I forgot my Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood flawless filter for a superstar youth glow oh guys I got all my nails off look at that all the nails are gone it's a beautiful sight and a strange feeling because my nails feel so weak and fragile Fragile? Why did I say that so weird? They just do. They're like paper thin. But when you stay up all night, you pick at your nails. And that's what I did. Little Hollywood Flawless Filter for a Superstar Youth Glow. I could see in my hairline so bad right now, but... What can you do? Just blend it out. When in doubt, blend it out. Excuse me, I burped. This whole little area. So what are you guys doing with your time? Give me some tips. What are you guys doing with your time sitting at home? If you are at home, or are you still working? Are your kids going to school? I don't think anybody's going to school. I'm feeling a little dry, so I'm gonna that helped. Okay. I've got this one like gray hair that's like a curl right here. It's really cute. 
It's really cute. Okay, and then my Hollywood Contour Wand by Charlotte Tilbury. And this one is in the fair medium. I'm gonna turn it on, squeeze out what I need. Just, you really barely need to squeeze it. Turn it back off and then apply. Cause that's how Charlotte says to do it, darling. Darlings. She calls everybody darlings. Charlotte darlings. Go, go back in with my flower beauty sponge, which I am obsessed with because it is literally the best. And just warm up my complexion even more because we're getting into those warmer months. I'm gonna really put it up in that hairline. And I put it up above my cheekbone because I want it to thin out my face. I don't want it to drag out my face or round it out even more, any more than it already is. A little over my nose. It's kind of like a W right here. And then bring it around. And that just product just blends like a dream. I mean, you guys have got to try this stuff. It is literally a dream to work with. I was very intimidated by it at first and I did not like it because I used a brush with it but now oh with a beauty blender mm. bellissimo and then my bare mineral bare minerals bird I cannot tuck talk I cannot talk bare minerals bounce and blur and blurred buff Blurred buff. I cannot talk. I'm so sorry. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. A couple bounces of that and kind of in the W. But mostly on the cheeks because it gets a little heavy on the nose. And I'm just going to blend it back into my contour. And I'm going to spin it around and kind of where there's no product on the sponge and kind of keep it away from my under eyes. Like so. Okay. Now we're going to do the eyes. And I'm going to use my Beautifully Bare Smooth Matte Eyeshadow. This is a different color and one of those eyeshadows that I love. Um, and I'm going to use a brush. Let's see. Let's try this brush. Oh, that's too small. I'm going to try it. Real Techniques um, Deluxe Crease Brush. And I am going to apply some. This is a very light color. What is it? Natural Linen. I'm going to apply it as a base. I'm not going to use it as just like a one color today. This formula feels different than the other ones. It's a little drier. I'm gonna apply it as a base for some eyeshadow. And I'm just kind of pouncing it in. I'm gonna bring it up pretty high because I'm gonna bring my eyeshadow up pretty high today. That's a pretty color, just kind of, it's a little darker than my skin tone. And I'm sure I could build it up to be more, but I just need it as a base today. You think when you put this formula on that it's gonna be awful? It's not, it's beautiful. It blends like a dream. I have all the colors now. They're four bucks on Elf's website. I can't, well, I don't know where my rose one is, but I just bought all the other ones the other day. I got them in. I shared them in a haul on my Instagram. If you want to go check that out. Actually, I posted it on YouTube by accident. So you can check it out on YouTube. There's a little mistake by me. It's kind of 
color corrects and just evens out your eyelids. I like it. Okay, then I'm going to go in with my NARS palette. This is the Summer Lights palette. Looks like these. See if I can open it without having any nails. Very good. This is what I look like. You got like a highlighter, a little deeper of a highlighter, and some eyeshadows. I'm going to go in with this light color right here and just buff it into the crease. No, I'm going to go in with um, this color right, right here. I'm going to barely tap it. Really tap it off my brush. That is a sticky base. It's kind of making it hard to blend. My son's playing a game with headphones on and he cannot hear anything when he's got those headphones on. So even if he's just talking, it sounds like he's screaming. I'm just going to put this on my whole lid. Kind of buff it out the way I did that other one. Same color, other eye. Our poor town, there is no toilet paper anywhere. We were trying to get some wet wipes the other day and they brought out a crate of them and people were just grabbing boxes and like taking off. And it's like they're not even trying to control the amount that people are taking. And then you go to like the Winco that we have. Winco is another, but it's like a company owned, like employee owned place. And they're controlling like how much people can take. And it's like the smartest thing I've seen people do since this whole thing started. I'm going to take a smaller brush and take this deeper color. I don't know how this is going to turn out. And just go on the outside. Like the outer V. Just a little bit. Kind of deepen up that outer V a little. So there's no wet wipes for our family. We use them for everything. So that's kind of sucks. I mean, I use them to clean my dog's muddy paws. I use them. My son uses them when he goes number two. I mean, it's like more important than. I'm going to go back over that first color and blend this out. Um, it's more important than toilet paper to us. You know what I mean? <laughs> my eyes look crazy. Crazy dark. But that's what I'm going for. Okay, let's see. Another brush with some dog hair on it. We're gonna blend out the whole thing. And this is a beautiful palette. It's again, Summer Lights by NARS. And these colors, these tones, tones, these colors really make my eyes pop. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do with that. I kind of clean up the outside with my booty blender on my flower beauty sponge. Okay, let's do some eyebrows. My camera is going to cut me off. I just know it. Every time I do my eyes, my camera cuts me off because I take too long. Okay, let's do the bad brow first, guys. So are any of you guys like... Not doomsday, but are you like preppers? Do I got any preppers on here? Let me know. Let me know what kind of stuff you guys got. I'm not a doomsday prepper, but I am a prepper. 
and I have stuff. I have like MRIs and I just found some um, pepperoni pizza ones that my son will eat and I ordered them for like overnight shipping so that my son will have stuff if we lose power that he'll actually eat. Which has eased some of my worries. That's my thing. I'm I'm worried about the power going out. I don't think that's gonna happen, but I that's my biggest thing. Right. Let's go to our good bro here. And it's always nice to me. We just don't have to do as much to it, you know? The poor mom is like, I just want some toilet paper. My daughter-in-law is the same way. She's in Texas. Her and my stepson are going on a mission today to find some toilet paper. And I wish them luck. I guess there was some toilet paper in a Target today that lasted, and that lasted like a whole 20 seconds. I don't know, are you guys sick of hearing about the coronavirus stuff, or are you guys cool with that? Cool with me talking about it. I can stop talking about it if you want. Little soap brow. I mean, what else is there to talk about? It's like everywhere. But I can talk about other things if you're just here for an escape from it. That's what I go on YouTube for. But I don't mind people talking about it at all. I mean, it, let's face it, it's all it's on all of our minds. It's on all of our minds, people. But if there's kids watching, I don't want to like scare them or something. Okay, eyes are done. And then I'm just gonna use my Milani Luminoso for my lips. Cause it's just my favorite thing. this face and do some mascara oh my camera is gonna stop ow I just poked myself right in the eye Typical gin. Oh, I got an itch. So if you just curl them up like this, there's like really no need to do anything else. I don't even have to do my little trick where I push them up with this after I put mascara on. Just get them in there and flip them up. And they stay curled all day long. Thrive Liquid Lash Extension Mascara. I was talking to my husband yesterday and he looked down at me. He's a tall fella. Camera cut me off. Don't ever do that again. That was very rude camera. Uh, but my husband hadn't seen me yet since I filmed and I was talking to him and he looked down at me and he goes, oh, you look really pretty today. Like, oh, no, oh. <laughs> thanks. And I have got something in my eye. I can feel it. Isn't that 
that sweet when your husband just tells you that? He tells me all the time, but when he's like surprised by it, <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. And I got mascara all over my eyelids. Let it dry. Let it dry. Dry. Yep. So it's dry and it just flakes right off with a spoolie. And there you go. All right, people. That's the look for today. All right. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you again tomorrow. I hope you like the eye look. I really tried today. I like it. I think it really brings out the blue in my eyes. What do you think? Anyways, I digress. Okay, I will see you guys tomorrow. Have a wonderful day. Stay safe. Be kind. Help people out. And oh, if you see an old person struggling, please help them. Please. They, they don't have anybody else. Okay, think about others. All right, bye.